Okay, here's a video of what has to be one of my top two favorite Tonka toys I'd ever had. This is the little dump truck with mortar mixer. It originally came also with a wheelbarrow. My wheelbarrow has gotten lost or had gotten lost. It was a shock that this truck still was around because back in the 80s my mom felt the need to have a tremendous yard sale and sell stuff dirt cheap. So most of my stuff was sold. So I would never expected this to still be here. But here recently we went up to one of the shops at my parents house and up in the rafters was boxes and boxes of old toys. I don't know who put them up there, but here is my Tonka truck with mortar mixer. I enjoy this very well. Now here's the truck itself. Now I'm a Ford man and always will be, but this truck right here reminded me of a Dodge. It always has and it will always remind me of a Dodge. And it is just a great, great Tonka truck. Uh, it has the white mags that I really favor. You notice that the letters on the tires are pretty much rubbed off the white that is. There's scratches, you know, it's not beat up, but I'm going to tell you this sucker hauled a lot of dirt, rocks, and gravel in its time. Uh, it actually, we left it at, up under the bridge at the creek during a flood, and it didn't, it got, fortunately got hung up and didn't go get washed away, so we rescued this one. Uh, the, the hitch is still on it. There's inside of the bed. Scratched up, losing paint, but, but hey, we play with our toys. Anybody that's my age, who's in the 40s, that had Tonka trucks, you know what it was about. And if you still have them, you know that they, they've got scratches, they've got rust, they've been beat up, and they're still going strong. My son, who is now 22 years old, played with this same truck. Just a truck. I didn't let him play with the mortar mixer because those are kind of hard to find and this is a complete set. That's the truck. Okay, here's the mortar mixer. And something I, I'm not a Tonka expert except for when it comes to playing with them as a child. But something I noticed not too long ago is that this, the, the, the mixer bed itself was on a another Tonka truck. It was a little Jeep Tonka truck. I think they were red. Uh, actually, it was red. It's the same exact motor barrel or whatever you call the mixer. It was the same mixer with the fenders and all that. It was just mounted to a truck frame. There, I mentioned that I didn't let my son play with this. Well, it was because of that. The tab. I've seen many of these at yard sales and flea markets and you know missing the drums, missing I think this is a water canister or supposed to be a simulated water can water canister. But when I find them, they're always broken on the tip. This one is not. My brother still exists as well. He does his is uh not in good shape. And his is missing the tip, the hook. I'm fortunate that mine is still there and it does not usually get hooked up. It usually sits in the bed of the truck on display. Now I said earlier that I was missing my wheelbarrow and that's true. It was gone. It was nowhere to be found, which is not a surprise because again, we wore these toys out. We played with them like it was nobody's business. I found this one on eBay. I think I paid $4 for it. And I, I, it was just a luck chance. I was, I kept looking and looking. I must have looked for a couple of months, and there it was. So I grabbed it as fast as I could. And now my set is 100% 100% complete. All right, there it is. There's my favorite, one of my most favorite Tonka trucks, with the mixer and a replacement wheelbarrow. I want to thank you for viewing my video. Leave a comments if you like. Uh, post videos of stuff you have that you don't see on YouTube because I'd really like to see them. Uh, there's a lot of stuff out there I've forgotten about.
that when I see it on YouTube brings back good memories if if even if it's something I didn't have I probably knew somebody that did have it thank you for watching my video and have a great day